Lord and always wonderful uh, for people to come and be able to share their heart with us, encourage us. Uh, anybody want to come and share this evening a testimony in the Lord? Anybody? Carol, come on up, sister. Well, <clears throat> being that my boys are so far away, I just adopted a son, <laughs> and it was just so, what a surprise for them to take us out to dinner today. It was such a blessing, and I appreciate Lee and Shannon so much, and the boys, and what a good time we had. And you know, sometimes, sometimes when your family are so far away, it's sort of sad when you don't have them with you. And even though they call you on the phone, it's still not the same. It's, it's better to have them right here so that you can fellowship with them and, and just spend time with them. But it was a blessing to me, and I really appreciate it, and I thank you so much. You never know when the Lord's going to come and bless you, do you? What a remarkable thing that was. I just heard just a little bit of the conversation today and, and Lee and Shannon asking the Downings to go out for a meal and stuff and enter in and treat her as their mom and spend time with her. What a, what a blessing. It really blessed their hearts and that's what it's about to walk with the Lord, isn't it? Where we can reach out to, to others. Thank the Lord for that. Thanks, Carol, for sharing. Thanks, Lee and Shannon, for being so willing to uh, step in where the Lord's leading you. Met the need of a family that needed that encouragement. Anybody else like to share uh, a testimony tonight? Anybody? Henry said no. <laughs> Maybe eventually. <laughs> we'll get him to come. Next Sunday. Okay, so next Sunday. See what the Lord has. Uh, well, if there's no other, nobody else wants to come forward and share, I'm going to bring uh, Brother Kurt up to lead us in another hymn.